So looking at this from far away, you may actually think that these plants are dead and they need to be replaced. But as you walk closer, you can see that these plants are far from dead. There's tons of vegetation that is nice firm stems, lots of eyes, and these plants are going to be perfectly fine in the next couple of months. But you need to know what to look for. So what looks brown from far away actually is really healthy and will look like lots and lots of promise going forward. So now I'm walking backwards again and then you can see how it looks from far away. If we would just fertilize this just a tiny little bit or water and fertilize this, it would actually green up almost immediately. Now, we are not really strong advocates uh, for fertilization on green roofs where it's not necessary, but this is a uh, this section of the wall and that's actually the section that is right over here. That is actually a hydroponic system. So that's 100% uh, mineral wool based uh, growing solution. And of course there's no, um, yeah, there's no soil there. So the plants need to have a little bit of a nutritional supplement. In this section in the middle, we actually, um, there are two water zones over here. And the water zones are actually one here and on one there. And that actually needs to be turned back a little bit. Now, and that just became evident here in the last couple of weeks. This is a matter of trial and error. Um, no big deal. We just need to turn it down just a little bit and uh, make a note of it for next year. Over here also, this section looks like it is brown and miserable. But then if you zoom in, you see that there are lots and lots and lots of eyes and these plants will be perfectly happy. And as I zoom out, you can see that that is the case. So we have there in the belly of the curve, we have a little bit of a uh, scenario where plants are just a little too happy. And right here at the verge of winter and spring, you see that's the, the area that's getting watered and fertilized is just a little bit ahead. This will all straighten out in the next couple of weeks. My compliments to the guys that are maintaining this. Something else that's worth noting is actually the section over here. Why is it that we have um, more um, you know, greener plants over here at the outer edge? This is actually a little bit of light pollution. Uh, there's light coming through this wall in the um, during the night and that is faking these plants into thinking that it is springtime already because the days are um, extra long. So we'll give you an update in March or April, but uh, I give this a 10 out of 10. Thanks guys.